Hey guys, how you doing? So, we're here with the A to Z series, and I'm playing Anubis. This is directly after the Anher game, if you were watching these in order, and I'm still very tilted. That was not a fun game. And now I've got to play what I would say is possibly the god I'm least comfortable with in the whole game. I mean, he's a hyper-aggressive god. He survives by blowing shit up, and... If you've been watching this and hearing my playstyle, that is not really a strength of mine. I'll be honest with you. I don't know if I should have taken that. Well, Nox is AFK, so yeah. At least I'm not the uh, weak link so far, but yeah. Um, he survives by beating the crap out of people. Is basically how it works. I have no idea how to build him whatsoever. Um, hopefully I don't upset any veteran Nox players with this. Oh god. By being awful. Well, that could have gone worse. But yeah, not something I'm uh, going to want, but we will be trying to play him somewhat aggressive, somewhat like how he's meant to be played. But don't be surprised if this is not the uh, type of performance that you. Ooh, he does blow stuff up, at least he does what he does. At least he's a lot of fun. Um, if I'm right in thinking, right back. protection stolen, okay. increased healing. Protection stolen. I didn't know you got a protection still with the passive, but yeah. The god is great. Um, if a little bit of a niche playstyle required, he's very unique, I would say. Um, at least that's how I feel. Oh, shit. Um, this is very bad. Oh, we're well, okay. Wasn't like we could do that. We were caught without anything. Simple as that. Don't know where that one. We're gonna set ourselves a little mini goal of beating the enemy Anubis. It is just one of those things that I, whenever I don't go out my way to focus them because that's just poor gameplay potentially, unless it's the right tactic, of course. But I'd be lying if I said that I don't uh, aim to beat my direct counterpart in the mirror. Paul and my part there to just go head to head with that Zeus. Luckily, it was a very nice shot I played on the uh, on the CC. You will see me building a lot of cooldown just throwing CCs out on gods that I'm not comfortable in because it helps the team. I'm very much big on team play when I have a team that's worthy of it. But this is looking like a good one at the minute. Probably should have jinxed it like that. Not sure if I should really be uh, holding off those CCs, like with the Nox route and things. Or whether we should just consider that we already have the kill, because it seems that when I ulted the last time it was a bit unnecessary. Obviously, I couldn't have known that at the time, that's why we ulted. Oh, that was so poor. Oh, um, yeah. Yeah, that was poor. I probably shouldn't have ulted there, in all honesty. Um, Okay. That was exactly what I was referring to with being uncomfortable on the god. That was just making all the wrong decisions. Getting my fingers all sorts of confused because I didn't know what I even wanted to do. Never mind what button was going to do what. Oh well. Better learn here than in ranked, right? In case you're wondering, I, uh, I haven't uploaded any videos yet. I do play ranked, but minimalistically, I'll be honest. Since I have some problems cancelling my run. Hmm. Pretty sure Noxious tried to root the uh, new patch buff damage Zeus. Okay, the pit is over. Not sure what he means by that, I'm not listening. Really scared over there by myself. Oh no, that was so unfortunate. Yeah, well, 
We did well to live as long as we did, in all honesty. I feel like Daji is just gonna bully us, in all honesty. Didn't have enough health there, if you were wondering why I didn't uh, go for the ult to save me. It just wouldn't have done me any good. At least that was my feeling on the subject. But yeah, we are feeding. But we don't care. More than happy to get carried. We've been over this before in our uh, Achilles game. Um, and I yeah, know. Uh, Thanatos is. They will do that. Exactly what's just happened. And there we go, there's the Penta. And now he's dead. Huh. Well, you know, it happens. I feel like it's going to be hard for me to hit my uh, 20 ticket goal that we do set ourselves. And um, by virtue of the fact that Thanatos going to get the kills, and I'm happy for him to do that. But like I always say, the, uh, the win does come first, so. Was that overkill? Yeah, that was definitely overkill. Oh well. At least it's somewhat uh, relieving to have a, a team that can carry me for a change. It does uh, it does make a nice change. We've had a couple so far. All of our teams so far have joined this series seem to have either been pretty damn good ahead of the curve or, well, awful. No, never a middle ground. Very rare that we are uh, getting any even matches at the moment. I'm sick of having to run back every few seconds. Probably should have adapted my uh, my default mage arena build. Definitely going to be getting the Aegis. Yeah, if you hadn't realised, I do have a sort of default build. It's, I don't like default builds because I feel like you should always be adapting to the circumstance, but given arena is fairly consistent and what it does. Oh this was poor. Coming out of my ult early cost me both of my actives and then I needed my actives afterwards because of coming out of my ult early so. Well rip me. Yeah. That's on me. I mean, I shouldn't have died there because she should have. As long as they got that kill, I was okay with it. I should be playing better than this and not having a strong game at all. No! Damn. It was a nice save from Nox there. <laughs> oh! That's unpleasant. I don't want to get anywhere near any of this. I am just getting blown up instantly. I think I need some sort of lifesteal, some sort of health, maybe. Uh, I'm I don't know the god well enough. I know it gets the benefits of lifesteal. I don't know if the lifesteal would be more beneficial than something with a bit of health on it. Some, I'm torn between lifesteal or gem. At the minute. I feel like gem could be horrible for them to deal with for the utility. I can't. I want both. I'm gonna get both, but it's uh, the order in which we get them. It's Paul. Paul using my three there. Be right back, be right back. Um, because of when we're choosing to back and how much we have, we're gonna go for the lifesteal first. And um, we're gonna get the soul gem. I like soul gem when I have an aggressive team, and then it's liking to dive in at the minute. It just gives me the option of. Uh, Well, that was something. Even if, like I say, even if all I can do is the team play, I'm happy to do that. Killing those minions there like a good boy. Run like hell. Mistakes were made. I shouldn't have run like hell. This was all wrong. That was my hesitation. But kill me. That is my personal weakness. I've been over this before. I am a little bit on the passive side, and that's what cost me that. I wanted to run. I should have full committed. I don't dislike that I'm passive, and um, I think most of the time I get the call right, and um, it's just the odd time like that one where, well, where it goes wrong, basically. Oh no, I thought I'd saved him. I mean, we're going to get her as well, but... I mean, I couldn't have done much more in all honesty to have saved them. But I still feel bad. Yeah. 
suck. <laughs> okay. Something sucks. Maybe there was more of a conversation I just wasn't paying attention. Um, at the moment, it looks like we're going to struggle to even hit positive with our tickets. I think we're at negative two at the minute. We are doing our job with the minions, and we have saved a couple of lives, but... We'll certainly not be the standout performer. You know, that's okay. You don't have to be the standout. Not for team wins. And when we're blowing people up like that, it's hard to even be a part of it. <laughs> As you can see. So this game's running a lot like the uh, the Achilles game that we had. In all honesty. It's uh, who knew? Anubis and Achilles? Same god. Jump party. Hmm. And then that one guy. That one guy is usually me. Oh shit, I've... I balls that up. I don't know if that was a smart plan. I want help, but I'm not getting out. Well, that was something. Um, that's how you do this. You just need to be a little luckier and well a little better than I am with it for it to work. I think with the gem there, we definitely would have survived. Would have taken less damage because they wouldn't have got to us as fast. We might have even escaped and obviously the extra health for them to burn through. Would have meant that the damage that we put out would have been sufficient because we'd have had the extra time to do it and get the kill. I don't know where he's really in at. Really? Zeus can detonate and kill me? Well, well, yeah, that's how it happens. That's how it works. Just putting out big numbers. Big numbers. Hopefully, not really. Not sufficiently big numbers. Should've gone for the three over the two. It just ruined me. I want to get that new this here to be honest with it. Like that. Oh, run. Many runnings. Many runnings away. I mean, 555, at least, would be inconsistent. One more would be a Star Wars character, and a pretty damn good one at that. I suppose that's something. Random, that's what the something was. Random. We've got our gem now. I think the three has a slow on it. Yeah, 25%. So between the two of them, we're going to be, uh, well, they're going to be static, aren't they? Let's get that out. I think we got him. Yeah, we got him. That'll do it. Yeah, and I should have just and waited for help. Like I said, these are the types of things that just come with not being comfortable on the god and also the fact that it's a little bit late, I'm not playing my best. I'm just not playing as well as I should be. And I feel like with such a close game that's gonna frustrate me a little bit because of the fact that I feel like we would have won if I ran better. Well we got an up. I'm happy with that. Not a fight I'd take as that Zeus, in all honesty, yeah. <laughs> Maybe if that uh, 10 on the clock wasn't there, if it was 3.45 instead of 13.45, that might have been uh, a little bit more his way. A little. Don't know why I held gank. It's not even what I really was suggesting. Of, but... Oh, we're just missing all of the things. Oh my, see, we're just throwing our damage out into places. And... Well, no. We finally learned what actives do, guys. We finally learned it. 
They delay your death ever so slightly. Skill might have been a better choice there. If, uh, if I had some of that, that might have been the way to go. Not giving up on this yet though guys, we've still got the uh, opportunity to win this game. We're getting rid of that. And we're gonna get our Typhon Spang. Double lifesteal with the conversion of lifesteal into the into power on the Anubis. I think that's the uh, the way to go. This is going in, and I can't even save myself, never mind stop it. I can defeat the minions with it. That's about And you know what they lost three people for it, which balances out tickets wise. It's fifteen, if you didn't know, for the big minion going into the portal, and obviously five are killed, so it does neutralise. The uh, the real difference there is the fact that we got some time where they were dead. That's the real advantage that we got out of it. I was hoping that Zeus was going to commit in then and I was going to turn him away. Probably should put that on instant cast. <laughs> this is... You don't want to run from your team. Your team can save you. I get running away is good if you can make it, but against Adagi you should never really try and fancy your chances of running away. And in truth, Thunder's not great at running away. He's fantastic at running too, with that passive, but not really that helpful when it comes to uh, getting out of there. Oh shit. Well, that, that happened. It wasn't us that was the death that cost us the game, but those eight Ah, the reason we lost that is a very poor performance on my part. There were mitigating factors, it's not my best god. We didn't have a comp that had any sort of support for me. And um, we didn't have any peel, more accurately. Or at least if what peel we had wasn't used as peel, we were very aggressive. Being that aggressive as a team means that we have to push up, and on an Anubis that is a problem because Oh, that's definitely wrong. The as an Anubis, that is very much a problem because of the fact that we don't have any mobility. So when we are pressed up like that, we are going to either get the kills, be happy, or we're going to die. And nine times out of ten, you are going to get the kills and then your team will be on a high and sit at the enemy base and you will just wait there until inevitably they come and they get you after this spawn and you die anyway. So, it's one of the reasons I don't play Anubis. I don't like immobile gods. You'll often see me building items that hamper the enemy's mobility and it gets us kills. So, if that's how the game works, why on earth would you choose a god that's immobile by default? It just doesn't make much sense to me. That is awful on our part. We should be doing considerably more than that. We were we were terrible. But like I say, we did do our minion job. It wasn't the best god. What can you do? I'll see you in the next one, guys.